Does Adam love Anna Stafford? And that's why Laurel and Betsy are just so pers or so obstinate in separating them. We have to wonder that truly, because if Adam truly did not love Anna, why is why are Betsy and Laurel so severe in separating and trying to blacklist her out of the family because he really did love Anna and I think he still does and what that is is a devil pinned on the family probably for Anna's sins also her parents sins her grandparents sins for Adam's sins his infidelities not really converting being not as strong in his faith, not getting that baptism he needed to have made him more vulnerable. Also, the sins of his father, that sexual promiscuity that that uh, chastised the marriage was not blessed. It was going to be blessed. So it was that really kind of vulnerable period in the marriage. And um, But everything can be restored. I'm not saying that particular marriage should be restored because... Uh, chastity is king and being chaste and even celibate is true love we know that marriages have middles beginnings and endings we know this is true even for the most beautiful marriages that you have ever seen have a beginning a middle and an end because in scripture it says um, the death separates or breaks that covenant now do I have a covenant with Adam no I do not because as a baptized Catholic I was married to him by a priest and you'd think that would be valid but the priest was a crook and he says himself he did not marry me in the church I was not married in a church I did not I was of low faith and I didn't really realize what was going on I thought I was getting married now I had a low faith I think I was in mortal sin I wasn't a very good person I was a concubine I was living with him uh, without the marriage covenant you know so in those respects I was uh, a whore you know, I was not living the way God wanted me to be. It was a terrible lifestyle. And that terrible lifestyle is still evident today in the Heifetz family. He should not be married to this lady. I think it was forced on him by Laurel. When she saw things, she got jealous. And it's all about her power and control. She even told me once, you've got to always be in control. 